Hey YouTube, this is Victor from San Diego Mac Repair. Today we're going to show you how to clean out malware out of your Mac, MacBook Pro or iMac. The process is free and is a great way to get rid of any pop-ups or malware in your Mac. Stay tuned for more videos. If you like our video, please like or subscribe to our channel. Thank you. First, we're going to go ahead and go to Google search. We're going to type in google.com on Safari or Chrome. You're going to see, I'm going to type in malware bytes Mac. Uh, we recommend going to their direct website, which is malwarebytes.com. You should see the screen like this. Cookies is okay. I'm going to go and do the free download. Now we can allow it, and it should go automatically into your downloads folder, which is this guy here. I'm going to double click on this guy here, and we're going to go and install it. Go ahead and continue, continue, continue. Hit agree. No problem. Install. Go and type in your password. Hit enter. Great, now we have the app here. So we're going to go ahead and choose close this one and then move to trash. We don't need it anymore. Go ahead and get started. We're going to do personal computer free. Since it's your personal computer, we're going to use Malwarebytes free. You can uh, opt into the pro paid program if you want to have more protection, but we just suggest the free version. We're going to go ahead and scan the system. Now, I don't really use this Mac too much other than for work purposes. So I don't really have any malware on it that I know of, so we'll go ahead and scan the system. A couple other places, so no malware found, great, hit done. So this is a free program, it's great. Um, Apple recommends it and stuff. So we're going to go to, the other thing we want to do is go to Safari Extensions. And you can see that there are extensions available, but we don't want any extensions at all. So we want to go to Safari Preferences. We want to go to Extensions. So Safari Preferences Extensions. Make sure that there's no extensions. That could mean that there are infections in your machine. Um, you're also going to want to go into Search. Make sure that that says Google. These look pretty good. Um, autofill. We also want to go into your home page. Make sure that this is like set to apple.com or google.com because a lot of the hijacked websites or browsers will go into a different website. So I'm going to close. Make sure that it's set to a proper one. So no extensions and make sure the general and home page is set to a proper page. Great. So that's done. Um, if you found malware, go and scan it. You will probably reboot. So go ahead and reboot your system. Uh, we're going to go back to Apple System Preferences. We should never see profiles here. If you see a profiles here, you're going to want to click on it. I don't have any here to show you, but if you have a profiles, click on it and then remove the profiles. There are other videos on how to directly do profiles removal, but you should be able to figure that part out. Um, so no profile should be in your system because that's what malware infects. So we can go ahead and close this guy out and it looks good. I highly recommend that you shut your computer off at least once to twice a week uh, to keep performance up on it. So if you found this useful video useful, please go ahead and like our video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.